from the newsroom at news.com.au. Australia's border protection regime has intercepted its second asylum boat in a month near the nation's shores as Sri Lanka's sharpening economic crisis emboldens people smugglers to test the resolve of the new Labor government. The latest asylum boat, intercepted by Operation Sovereign Borders, carried 15 men who had left Sri Lanka on May 21st, the day the Morrison government lost office and Labor won majority government. The men were brought ashore at Christmas Island and taken directly to the airstrip where a government-chartered SkyTraders Airbus took them back to Colombo. Meantime, Jacinta Ardern has touched down in Australia, becoming the first foreign leader to meet Anthony Albanese on home soil. The New Zealand Prime Minister, who arrived in Sydney via a commercial flight yesterday, had an informal dinner at Kirribilli House with Mr Albanese ahead of talks today. The father of an 11-year-old boy found alive after going missing has been arrested after police discovered a drug lab in his home. Christopher Wilson was found safe after going missing in Sydney's Hills District and spending the night in freezing temperatures. He was reported missing after failing to return home on Wednesday afternoon. Police went to give the boy's 28-year-old father the good news after a member of the public spotted him walking along the road just before 9.30am yesterday but when police officers arrived at his house, they allegedly found a locked room which contained a suspected drug lab. The father was arrested and taken into custody but has not yet been charged. Finishing with entertainment, and Rebel Wilson has come out as a lesbian after posting a photo to social media of her new girlfriend. Wilson wrote on Instagram alongside of a photo of new girlfriend, LA-based fashion designer Ramona Agruma, I thought I was searching for a Disney prince, but maybe what I really needed all this time was a Disney princess. Hashtag love is love. Get the latest from news.com.au.